Today, we are going to start off by taking a big breath in and then letting it out with a sound. Ready? Big breath in. And out with a sound. <sighs> and big breath in. And out with a sound. <sighs> and one more time. Big breath in. In slow motion. Blink in slow motion. Think in slow motion. Keep moving through the space, moving even more slowly than you think you need to. Think about the shapes that your body can make. 
while you're moving in slow motion. You can even start to think about how your body can carve through the space. How do your elbows help get the air out of the way so you can keep moving through? Think about the angles of your shoulder, your knee, the top of your head. Try leading with different body parts too. What is it like if you move so that your stomach leads the way? What kind of character might you be if your stomach is the first part of your body that connects with the air in front of you or your nose? What is it like if you move with your nose leading you? And you can drop the call of slow motion now. Just listen to the body parts I tell you to lead with. What about your knees? What happens if your knees lead you first through space so they're the first things that the air touches? What about the top of your head? What happens if the top of your head is the first thing that connects with the air around you and freeze and shake all that off. Oh. Um, the next thing we are going to do is take what we just explored and apply it to a game of red light, green light. Now, a lot of you have probably played red light, green light before. It's a great game. At Pivot, we do it a little bit differently where we add some calls. Um, or directions. So, we're going to have to play this round of red light, green light on the honor system. So, tr I'll have to trust that you freeze when I call red light. Um, find a patch of space. It doesn't even have to be very, very large. Um, but just something that has a clear start and finish. So, where is your starting line? Are you up against the wall? Do you make it to the other end of the room, the other wall? Is that your finish line? Take a second and just decide that. And then I'm going to start giving you directions. And as I give you the directions, play along and take those directions on. So for this round of red light, green light, we are in the Queen's Palace, and it is beautiful. Oh, the stained glass windows are stunning. And there are sculptures from all of the famous artists from the last 10 decades. It's amazing. And on the floor, there is a beautiful, brand new carpet. It is so soft, it feels like you're stepping onto a cloud, and it's absolutely, completely clean. It's so new that dust hasn't even fallen on it yet. Now, your job in the kingdom is chief tea expert. You are the queen's go-to person for all things concerning tea. And the queen of England drinks a lot of tea. So your job today was to show up to the kingdom, walk up to the castle doors with your newest brew. So this tea that you've been perfecting, that's at the perfect temperature in a gorgeous cup made out of fine china. You have to deliver it to the queen. And in order to do that, you gotta walk across the carpet. And not only that, you have to make sure you don't spill the tea. You just... The queen is protective about a few things, and one of them is this carpet. So, be careful. Now, Grab the cup of tea. For me, I, I left it on the shelf right behind me. And it's, it's really quite hot. So I'm carefully kind of pinching the handle 
um, between my fingers so I don't burn myself. And I notice how full the cup is of hot liquid. It's filled almost to the brim and I don't want to spill it. Any slight jostling and it would end up on the floor. But I do want to take a second and smell the tea. Hmm. Chamomile. So get to your starting point and using that slow motion call, be so, 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 so careful that you don't spill any of the tea on the queen's new carpet. You're going to start moving across the carpet, looking at the tea, looking at the queen, looking at the tea, looking at the queen, and red light. Oh, I didn't call green light, did I? And make sure all the tea is still in the cup. And green light. And red light. Check in with yourself. Take a deep breath. And green light. Red light. Green light. Look at the tea. Make sure it's all in there still. And if you haven't gotten to the queen yet, no worries. I think we've all earned a nice cup of tea. So, cheers. And let's all take a nice big sip from our cup of royal tea. Hmm. Well, thank you for joining me for Morning Movers and for a nice spot of tea. I can't wait to see you again soon.